seniors. I'm sure you've heard the term unprecedented about 11 million times at this point. But here we are again, feeling like it's unprecedented that we can't celebrate you in person today. If we were in the sanctuary together, I know we would say your names aloud. And so I want to say your names aloud so that you know that you are seen and loved and that we continually lift you into God's love. So, Lauren, Ashley, Ginny, Cade, Frankie, Lauren, Hadley, Nick, Andrew, Richard, Grace, and all others graduating this year, we see you, we know you, we love you, we support you. It has truly been a privilege for me to get to know you and see you turning into young adults. So now go out and do good, be good, be kind, take care of others, and know that always when you need taken care of, we will be here. This church family has seen me through good and some very, very tough times. And this church, your church family, will do the same for you. We will continue to say your name and love you and support you. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2020. Godspeed on your journey ahead. Congratulations, seniors. You did it. You wrote all the papers. You took all the tests. You've done all the projects, even those that you weren't so excited about. And now you've done it. You've graduated. I'm so excited for you and for, for all the things that you have done and for all the things that you will do. Um, as you get ready for your next adventure, there's one thing I want you to remember. You are loved. You are loved. You are loved. You are loved. Oh, wait, what? Oh, that's right. You're loved. I hope that you will take this with you, remembering that no matter what comes along in life, no matter where you go or what happens, you are deeply loved. That is the hope and promise that Christ gives us. So go in God's blessing, knowing that you are loved and that Ladue Chapel can't wait to welcome you home. Hey guys, this is Dieter. I know this is not what you had in mind for graduation this year, but uh, congratulations to your achievement. Uh, we love you, we keep you in our prayers, and we hope you will have a good summer, uh, regardless of uh, what we're all going through right now. So blessings to you, and congratulations again to you and your families. Well done, grads. graduates. This morning I'm thinking back over the past 15 years and remembering the ways that many of us have spent time together, first in chorister choir and later carol choir, youth choir, previous youth Sundays, the children's choir's musicals, uh, VBS, first as students and then as helpers, and Christmas Eve services with playing the violin and the piano. And I just want to say congratulations and best wishes from Mr. David.
morning and God be with you. In the few months that I have been with you here in the Ladue Chapel community, it is clear how much your church family loves and cherishes each one of you. May God bless and keep you as you move into the future and become the leaders that the church and the world needs. Thanks be to God. Amen. Graduates, congratulations on your achievement. I'm sorry that we haven't been able to get together these past few months, but I'm glad for the time I had to get to know many of you through Urban Plunge and Sunday Evening Youth. We will miss your intelligent questions and thoughtful opinions. Keep questioning always, and remember, history matters. I wish you the best for the future and hope you will let us know how you're doing. loves you. We're here for you. I hope everything's going well. Wear the mask. Be safe. Make good life choices. Hopefully I'll get to see you guys soon and we can have some fun this summer. Congratulations, seniors! Your hard work is not unnoticed, and I know it's been a crazy end to the year, but we are so proud of you. Your parents are proud of you, your families are proud of you, the church is proud of you, and um, we can't wait to see where life takes you. <laughs>